and in this video lecture i'm going to do the integration of dx divided by sin square x into cos square x so let's see the answer so first here i'm writing the given so here this is dx divided by sin square x into cos square x or we can write 1 into dx divided by sin square x into cos square x so we can easily achieve the output if I use here in place of 1 we can write sin square x plus cos square x divide by sin square x cos square x here dx now thereafter make the relationship with sin square x and here this cos square x so here we can write sin square x divided by sin square x cos square x thereafter cos square x divided by sin square x cos square x now here write the dx this sin square cancel this cos square cancel so after doing that here we can write 1 by cos square x plus 1 by sin square x here dx now the next is here 1 by cos square x that is equal to sec square x 1 by sin square x that is equal to cosec square x here dx or we can write here sec square x dx plus integration symbol cosec square x dx sec square x integration that is equal to tan x here plus cosec x square x integration that is equal to minus cot x here c is the constant this plus minus that multiply then you can get tan x plus minus minus here cot x plus c is the answer so this is the final answer of this question so only the trick is here in place of 1 we can write sin square x plus cos square x make the relationship with after that to uh, convert 1 by cos into sec and 1 by sin into cos sec use the formula sec square integration tan x and cos sec square integration minus cot x so this is the way we can do the integration of this question so i hope guys this video is helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you